Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 29th. Now, keep in mind that the timing is fluid, and not every reading is for you, so we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for a message today? today for right around the 29th. Now keep in mind the timing is fluid. Oh, I had some people ask me if I was going to sell some more of my decks um, that I created. Yes, I'm going to release some more of those tonight or tomorrow night. So yeah, 30 more. I have 30, and then I have to order more. So I'm going to, I'm going to release 30 more of them. And if you have purchased a deck, I'm going to ship on Monday. So what do we have for a message today? The ones that have already been purchased. If you if you purchase now, there's a little bit of a wait. So anyway, what do we have for a message today? Nine of Swords reverse, giving deep thought to a relationship, giving deep thought to a situation, feeling stressed out, having a hard time, thinking about it a lot. It's interesting because before I turned on this camera, I was thinking, and I was going to start the reading out with this, but I got sidetracked. Um, I put my phone over there. I got sidetracked, so I forgot. Um, what should I invest in? What should I invest in? What? And then, then I think this is an overall energy because I was just sitting here getting ready to start my reading. And I was thinking, what should I invest in? Should I invest in this? Should I invest in that? Should I block this person? Should I not? Should I burn this bridge? What should I do? What is my value? What do I do? What do I, what, you know, those are the questions that I was hearing right as I was getting ready to start. What do you, what, what is your value? What is your value? Um, what are you investing in? You know, so this is giving deep thought, you know, it's examining a situation, examining a relationship that is causing you some sort of stress. Or we have somebody here that is under some sort of despair or stress over a relationship in over a situation that uh, they are reevaluating right now. Um, should I continue to do this? This is this is causing me anxiety and despair and depression, you know, and worry, you know. So yeah, I think there's some sort of worry here. Something not putting in effort. Thinking. This is thinking a lot. Sh should I put in effort or not? Somebody is probably not putting in effort. Something's not working out. They're not, they're not putting in enough. They're not giving enough. They're not trying hard enough, which is causing these thoughts, which is causing this despair and worry. And what comes before this eight of pentacles is the seven of pentacles, which is investment. Should I invest in this? Should I? Should I? Ah, what's coming in the future? Well, there's a lot of other options, and that's what's going on here. We have a lot of other options. Uh, there's many choices. There's multiple choices, uh, and this is becoming clear of a choice. There's obviously, this is obviously a stressful decision. Something, somebody's not putting in effort, not much anyway, maybe giving crumbs or something like that. They're not putting in much effort, which is causing somebody to overthink and, you know, be in a state of uh, worry, depression, anxiety, despair. But this is becoming clear of the choice when there's other options. Somebody has other options. Now, when you think about the Seven of Cups, the Seven of Cups is what be careful because what you own owns you. So if you choose to focus on something or somebody that is not putting in much effort, then, hey, then there's consequences to that. And that's going to be despair and worry and anguish and depression. You know, so you can you can choose another option. You can choose. And that's what's going on. It's interesting because that's what I was sitting here before I turned the camera on. That was what was going on through my head. And this is exactly what we have here. We have somebody here that has 
multiple choices. They have multiple options. And right now they're giving deep thought as to what choice that they should choose. What, what should I invest in? What should I, what, what, you know, what should I invest in? You know, should I invest in something that isn't really putting in much effort or should I choose another option? I do think there's clarity that is coming. This is becoming clear of a choice. Oh, Hermit and the Knight of Swords. So the Hermit is going within, reevaluating, uh, realizing something, probably the truth, because this is the truth. Uh, this is a realization, uh, enlightenment, seeing the light. Just doing it. Must, I must, I must. Somebody, somebody could be coming in. Somebody could be coming in really, really fast as well. This is an arrival. Uh, this is somebody that is wise, that is, uh, has a lot of wisdom, very honest and truthful and does communicate. This is a communicator, a talker, somebody that takes action, that knows what they want that doesn't have any fear, that is very awakened, very enlightened, very, very wise. Interesting. That's one of the, uh, there could be two options here. Or I've, there's several. This is multiple choice, okay? There's multiple choices here. But this is reflecting, taking a time out to think. Yes. So we got a lot of thinking going on. Thinking about what is the best option. And I do think that we have somebody here that is stressed out. They're stressed out and they're stressed out because they're dealing with an individual that isn't putting in much effort, right? Maybe they could, maybe this person isn't putting in much effort because you're just an option, right? You're just an option. You know, we got options here. We got options. Ah, okay. So anyhow, the Knight of Swords is putting plans in action. Uh, making an approach there could be a, there could be somebody that is is coming in this is a sudden arrival could be a sudden departure this is honest truthful communication um, somebody that is very talkative that is throwing themselves into a situation they decide to just do something somebody could also be realizing the truth about an option this is definitely a realization the truth gotta go gotta go making an exit as well somebody may be uh, deciding to go down another path um, in a hurry it seems like this is in a hurry it's and i feel like they may be deciding to go down a path in another, another path in a hurry because they've become enlightened in some way they've gotten some sort of clarity they've gotten a light bulb moment maybe it's an epiphany i gotta go I got to go. There's a better option here. There is. There is a better option. Somebody has been uh, really thinking about their options. They've been uh, struggling, having a hard time sleeping, thinking about it a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, lot. Um, we have somebody here that wants to get ahead of the rest, you know, that wants to... to uh, be in the front, you know, that, that want something about the competition. That's what I just heard. Um, the hermit is typically a wise man, a wise individual. This is taking action right now. Somebody is, is coming in or they're arriving or they're, they're taking a stand or they're doing something right now. This is somebody that doesn't have any fear. They are very matter of fact. They don't want to be alone. They, and this is I don't want to be alone. And that's what's causing these thoughts. You know, I don't want to be alone. Who the hell wants to be alone? Seeing very clearly. And this is a card of consequences for the choices that you make. So somebody is going to be suffering some consequences or they or something like that. This is coming up with a plan, uh, plan B. This is plan B. <laughs> Knight of Swords, that is taking a risk. Somebody is going to be taking a risk. Uh, 
Ah, making a very big offer. Something solid, stable, secure, real. Okay, there is a real, solid, stable, truthful uh, offer that is coming. There's been some sort of delay. We have somebody here that is a hard worker that has a lot to offer. The Knight of Pentacles is a planner. This is somebody that uh, does know their value. This is somebody that builds a strong foundation and works hard to build foundations. We have a hard worker here that is very, very intelligent. There's two options here, by the way. There's at least two options here, just so you know. We have somebody here that has at least two options. I'd say more <laughs> if it was me. Anyhow, they have two options and they need to make a choice and they're going to become clear of the choice. We have a loner here who has been alone that, you know, there's there's a couple options here. We have somebody, or it could be one person taking on both energies, somebody coming in, there's been a delay. But this is this is this is no fear. It's, it's uh, hasty, in a hurry, coming in in a hurry with a solid offer. Somebody's coming in in a hurry with a solid offer. No kidding. Mm. This is a wake up call of some sort. Now you got to make a choice. Um, that hermit is take time to, to reflect, to go within, to plan your next move, spending time alone, realizing the true identity, and you need to listen to yourself and listen to yourself only. I feel like we have somebody here that has been listening to others and they need to listen to themselves only because the only person that is going to, um, make you happy is you. You get, what what that person feels and that person thinks is not you, you know, whoever's giving this poor advice. Anyway, the hermit is a time to go within and and make some sort of decision next to this card. So there is some sort of clarity. Both of these cards, all three of these cards, we have clarity here. Somebody's going to be receiving a clear message. Could come from within, could come from another person that helps them to decide what route to take. Knight of Pentacles is a golden opportunity. And there's some sort of test here. Somebody is, 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 there, is it, this is like a test of your value. It is. It's a test of your value. What are you worth? What are, what what are you what is your value? Interesting. Very interesting. Anyhow, um I think that we have a very uh clever, sharp individual that is making an entrance. This person is headed towards uh somebody that is very stable, solid, secure, uh, loyal, hardworking. They are headed towards this person very, very fast. Queen of Cups. Ten of Swords Reverse. Ten of Swords Reverse, the straw that breaks the camel's back. You made your bed, now you need to lie in it. Uh, this is a, I mean, the Ten of Swords Reversed is a uh, problem, okay? there's This is uh, extremely painful, extremely painful betrayal of some sort. There's some sort of pain here. The worst has happened. This is this is like liberation, freedom, breaking free, breaking free from a painful experience, choosing another option, following the heart, acting on emotions. Somebody may also be telling somebody the truth. They may be coming clean with the truth, being honest and upfront about their feelings. They're going to be shedding some light as to why they're not putting in much effort. 
This is about love. It's about self-love. It's about self-worth. We have somebody here that is looking for love. They have been alone. They have been alone or something like that. And, and you can be in a relationship and be alone. There is somebody here that is looking for love. And I feel like they have an arrival here. There is somebody that is arriving or they have arrived or something like that. Choosing another option. Following the heart in a new direction. Being practical. Acting with integrity. Doing the right thing. Moving in a hurry. I think this is something that is very, very emotional here. Somebody's about to become enlightened. They are with the truth, the facts. Hangman could be dealing with the Pisces. This is some Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I mean, it is what it is. We have everybody. It doesn't really matter. But this is thinking a lot. A lot of thinking going on. Thinking about uh, a foundation. Thinking about stability. Thinking about value. Thinking about worth. Thinking about the truth. Thinking about what path. Thinking about the future. And I think we have somebody here that's just about done thinking. They're about to make a move because they don't want to be alone, whether they're in a relationship or not. This is, I don't want to be alone. You know, there's another option. It's a better option. And I got to go. I got to go. This is, I got to go. I got to go. Good luck. <laughs>